layer them, textiles. Um, I could even get some stools and reupholster them with fabric I already have. And then also you'll see here from the rendering, this is a really beautiful space for fitting rooms. You know, ample room for your big booty friends and uh, a really safe space for our clientele because that's really important. Look at you coming in here and slamming your big titty on the table. But that's the kind of initiative we need. And I'm gonna follow your lead that we do this in Dumbo. Oh, uh, amazing, I love that so much, thank you. And um, you know what, these drawings were $400, can I just get paid back for reimbursed with petty cash? Or is that what collateral's for? <laughs> Is it hotter in here than Paula Dean's place in hell? Who oh, Paula Dean? Well, um, that was probably before you were born. It's just racism and butter. It's hotter here because Con Ed isn't getting back to me. I filled out the form online three times. I even did virtual assistant. Really? Well, have you tried picking up the phone and calling? I'm sorry, talking on the phone is a personal boundary of mine, so. Ah. So it's uh, it's hot as fuck, right? We have no lights, we have no electricity, and we have a whole weekend of work we can't do because Hannah Montana's scared of the phone. Actually, that's not an insult because she's a complicated female character with a job and a secret. <laughs> hey, Noah. Mm -hmm. For your help, I would just go take a walk right now. Oh, uh, okay. You can go. Thank you so much. Go, 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 Hey, Marlon. Uh, I know she didn't call Con Ed, okay? Uh, maybe that job was too big to give her. You know, she's really good at a lot of other things. And the Adi Body Bridal pop-up is at capacity with RSVPs because of her. Uh, Girl, if you don't get your ass up and do your job, what are you? Is, is the event over? How to go? No, 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 no. It's been 15 seconds, and I'm so sorry we interrupted you, okay? Okay, you know what? Stop. Stop it. Stop it. We have a bunch of brides coming here in just a few days. We are nowhere near ready. What part of that don't you understand, Nala? And to be honest, I didn't want your little chaotic ass here in the first place. Marley, you are going way too rough on her right now. Now, you're the one that asked me for my advice, right? And to be honest, ladies, nobody was going to give you a damn loan with your two-digit credit score. Wow. Okay. Well, you're the one that told me that you believed in me. You also said you wanted to help black creatives. So let us create. As a child of divorce, this is actually really triggering for me. I'm, I'm triggered. I'm out. What? What do you mean you're out? Out. That is what it I'm out. Are you mad at me? I'm so sorry. Don't be mad at me. Are you mad? I'm no. mad. But I'm not mad at you, okay? Nala, we gotta be like Denzel Washington in every movie. We gotta land that plane coked out, okay? We gotta bring the train back on the tracks and go home and have dinner with Rosario Dawson, okay? We need to find a liver or something for our summer, some kind of organ. I don't remember John Q like that. Not the point. We're gonna get this done, okay? You're gonna stay here and keep setting up. I'm gonna get the lights on, and then it's gonna be on! Talk to your girl. For real. I mean, I'm sick of this shit. Ugh. How did you get in here? You think I don't know people? This is my house. And what the fuck you got on? You can't afford no shirt? You can't afford sleeves? What's that? Put something on. I want to look at this little nappy ass chest. This is my house. Okay. Well, I don't know how I got dragged into this. It was maybe somebody sent me a 10 minute voice memo. So. Speak your piece. Yo, she will not take any of my advice, bro. Like, seriously. And this is what I do. I mean, what you gonna teach Serena how to serve, teach Mary J. Blige how to dance? Okay, Paul, well, you hopped on the idea with her. You gotta stop coming up with that corporate drill sergeant shit. Look, in the army, if you boot dirty, you get yelled at. But what's that got to do with the actual battle? Follow orders and listen to your commander. Okay, but are you a commander or are you a partner? I'm 